champions of 2009. This thing is awesome. Do you like cars? Do you like working with your hands? Do you like doing different things every day and making great money while doing it? Well, come on down to Arapahoe Community College's automotive program where we train the top technicians in the country. Let's show you around. Our program is unique, not only for Colorado, but the entire country. We only train future professional technicians. This program is designed for people that want to make this a career. If you see yourself doing this type of work 10, 15, 20 years from now, and it could be in various different levels. You may start off as a technician and you may eventually change your mind and want to manage the particular facility that you're working in. Or you may want to open your own shop and be a business owner. This is the launching pad. When you're looking for a career that you're going to make money in, that you're going to have fun doing, if you're the right kind of person, this is the one for you. You know, a job's a job, but a career is where you have fun. The first time you actually fix it and it works, I mean, it's really cool. And then you realize you can do it, and then you can start doing more and more. If you go there with a good attitude, you'll leave out of there with the best experience you'll ever have. Most of the manufacturers have deemed us their training facility. General Motors, Chrysler, Nissan, as well as others. So they have donated over $1 million worth of brand new vehicles to our program so that you're learning on the latest technology. Having the newest technology just helps us be ready when we go out into the world because that's how it is. You're going to work on older cars, and, but mostly newer cars. It's amazing the type of technology that you never would have expected in these kinds of cars. I mean, they got a couple Corvettes out there, they got a Prowler, I mean, you can basically work on all the new state-of-the-art cars, all the new fast, high-tech vehicles that come out on the market, and it's just amazing all their availability to get those cars from the companies just so we could get a better education. Students really love the cars they have a chance to work on here at ACC, and that's because of the partnerships we have with the industry ties. General Motors provided us with a 2010 Camaro before it even hit the dealer's lots. A gentleman from the factory come down and taught a class on the car. The car pulls in the shop, and students are taking uh, pictures with their camera phones left and right. It's like a rock star pulling into a, a big uh, concert. It was awesome. We had a couple different local uh, news channels pick it up, and they were here, you know, taking footage of it. So students really got excited about that when they got to be on TV. That's not unusual. Usually a couple times a year, the news is down here covering some live events we have. The Motorsports Club is another great example of that. We've got a drag car that we get to race at Bandemir. Students worked on the car here, built the car, tested the car on our dynamometer. We have a brand new Mustang II dynamometer that can measure horsepower, torque, IM240 emissions test. They tuned the car, got it all ready for the track, and they're ready to rock and roll. Now, when we're talking about our million dollar inventory, we probably have two million dollars of the individual components. Things like this Viper engine. We also have uh, North Star engines. We have enough that each student is not waiting on or fighting over an engine or a transmission. Same with differentials or any other component, electrical, electronics, heating and air conditioning. You will know all eight of the ASE areas very well and be capable of passing the certification exam by the time you complete our program. The technology is changing by the minute. It really is something students need to come and get a solid foundation for their education before they get out in the field. Along with our program, we have apprenticeship. You're working while you're going to school, which means you're getting paid to go through our program. Our industry right now, our technicians are starting to age, so we need to get quality replacements trained and in place before that happens and they start to retire. So we use a lot of the older technicians to mentor these younger kids coming in so we can get them the proper habits uh, to work on these vehicles. It's been really reaffirming and it's been a real confidence builder to be here and to learn the things so then to turn around and go to work the next day and do the same thing that you just learned here. It's like, hey, I don't have to ask so-and-so here at work for help on how to do this. It's really nice.
I worked in my apprenticeship position for two years while I was finishing up my degree. Then you're on your own. And I didn't feel like lost. I knew what I was doing. I just hopped right into it. We take great pride in the success of our students. When they go on and they become big shots, the lead tech somewhere, or they become the service managers of a $5 million service dealership operation, or they own their own business, we feel that a little bit of ourself is in with them. So we can point to them and say, you see that guy? I remember him when he first came here and now look at them. Not only did I like it, but I knew that there would always be a demand for auto technicians no matter where you live, no matter what kind of car you drive, there's always going to be work there for you to do. If you're professionally, formally trained through our program, two years after graduation, our students are averaging about $50,000 a year. With eight to ten years out from the program and with master certification, Many of our technicians are making close to $100,000 a year. So the money is there, the self-satisfaction of being able to do something that probably only 1% of the entire population can do, and that's fix a modern car. And you get this every single day that your car comes in not running or not running well. And because you have the ability to lay your hands on and repair it and to get somebody's life back online again, it's a great opportunity. It's very well paying, not gonna lie. <laughs> Just right up front, we are making more than most people will anywhere else. The cool thing about um, Auto Tech is that you can specialize in almost anything. You can specialize in engines, or you can specialize in brakes, or even uh, the technological part of it. You can specialize in computers or electrical work. It's a huge, broad range of what you can specialize in. And if you get your foot in the door here and start taking those classes and finally figure out what, what part of it you do like, I mean, that's where you make a lot of your money. With the knowledge you get from the school, you can go in to just about anywhere. And working at dealerships, you get additional training. But having my basic knowledge from my just two years at ACC, uh, I mean, I will probably work in the auto industry the rest of my life. We work really hard here. We study hard. We're, in, we're really immersed in automotive day and night because they're going to classes, they go to work, and it's a full two-year program. However, we do like to have fun as well. We go to the new car show and we take the students there so they can see what's coming out and what they're going to be working on in the future. So it's relevant as well as fun. It's very cool to be able to just know every part of the car that's out there so you, it actually makes the car show experience a lot better and to actually know how much they spent to build that car is actually kind of cool too. <laughs> now that you've seen what our students get to do, what do you think? Would you rather train for a job in an office cubicle or train for position using your hands, making a six-figure income? Come on down and see us at Arapahoe Community College's automotive program. Sky's the limit. You can, you can do whatever you want. You can start as a technician, you might start as a porter and work your way up. Whatever you like to do, it just depends on where you want to go and where you want to stop.